Immortal, Chapter 33 Author's Note I said shut up, it's not my fault, Og. If you don't flick the story, then you're a prep, so fuck you, Flamers1111. One, 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 one. Puz am not updating up till you give me Fiv God reviews and diss him, I meant it. 1111111, one, 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 one. you suck, 1111. One, 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 one. Thanks, Raven, for thy help. Ill promise to help you with your story, lols, one. Oh my fucking god, one, I shooted sadly. Should we get you to St. Manga's, bitch? Hell no, she said. Listen, Egogi, I need your help. Next time you go back in, Tim, do you think you could ask Tom Anderson for some help? Sure, I said sadly. I went outside the door. Draco was there, one one one. He was wearing a big black GC t-shirt, which was his Panama's. Hey, sexy, I said. How'd it go, Enerby? He asked, and his voice was so sexy and low, kind of like Gerard Way when he's talking. Fine, I repondered. We started to go back into the dorm. How far did you go with Satan? Draco asked jealously. Not too far, lol, I balked. Will you have to do it with him? Draco asked angstily. I hope not too far, one one one, I shouted angrily. Then I felt bad for shooting at him. I said sorry. We French. What happened to Snipe? I growled. You will see, Draco giggled mistressly. He opened a door. Snap and Lumpkin was there, one one. Sirius was pokering them by staging them with a black knife. No, pause, one 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 one. Lumpkin bagged as Sirius started to suck his blood. I laughed statistically. I talked some photons of him and Snap being talked. Oh, I know this is men, but think about it. Pull they are pedos and Snap tried to wrap them in at no way sad is rock has anyone seen Shrek attack three lol we took some of snipe's blood and then draco and i went back to our rooms we sat on my gothic black coffin my clothes were kind of dritty so i put on a black leather outfit thingy kind of like the one sueline has in underworld if you haven't heard of it then fuck you one 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 i put on some black platform high heels Darko put on Desolition Livers by MCR. Then, we started to take off each other's clothes. I talk of his shit and he had a six pack lols. We started to mack out like in the grudge. He put his wetness in my you know what sexily. I got an orgy. Oh Draco! One 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 exclamation point one. Oh me fucking god Draco one 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 one. I screamed passively as he got an erectation. I love you ta ebery he whispered sexily and then we fell asleep lol. Chapter 34 Author's note to shot da fuck up preps one 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 one. Have you even read this story one one? You are probably all just preps and poses, so fuck you one one one. Thanks to Raven for the help one. I woke up in the coffin the next morning. Draco was gone. I got up and put on a tight black sex address that was all ripped at the end. There was red corset stuff going up at the front and the back, and it came up to my knees. There was a slit in the dress, like in Mister and Mister Simph. I put on ripped black fishnets and black stilton boots. Suddenly, Saurius cocked on the door. I opened it. Hi, Ebony, he said. Guess what, you have to come to Professor Sinistor's office. Walk, I said in a depressed voice. I had wanted to fuck Draco or maybe lesson to MCR or Evanescence. I came anyway. So what the fuck happened to Snipe and Lupin? I asked Saurus flirtily. I fucking tortured them, he answered in a statistic way. They are an Abkhazian now, lol. I laughed evilly. Where are Draco and Vampira? I muttered. They are excused from school today, sodomized moaned sexily. Right now they are watching The Nightmare Before Xmas. We went into the office. Professor Sinister was there. She was wearing a gothic black dress that was all ripped over it, kind of like the one that Amy Lee wears in this pic. She was drinking some Volksimort serum. She took out the pensive and the time torner. Enemy, you will have to do a nozzle session now. Also, I need you to get me for the cure for being addicted, she said sadly. Good luck. Thanks. And then, I jumped into the pensive again. Suddenly, I looked around. I was in the Great Hall eating Count Chocula. It was morning. I was sitting next to Satan. On a table was a tall gothic man with long black hair, pale skin and blue eyes, wearing a suit and black Cronverse shoes. He looked just like Charlin Manson. I noticed. He was drinking a portent. Who's he? One one I asked. Oh, that's Professor Slutborn, Satan said. He's the portent teacher. Ebony? Yeah, I asked. 
Did you know that Marilyn Mason is playing at Hogsmeade today? And they are showing the exercise at the movies before that? Yeah? Well, want to go to the contort and the movie with me? Chapter 35 Author's Note Thanks to Susie for the idea. One, you rock. Fuck off preps. One, 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 one. Thanks to Raven for thy help. You rock, girl. One, Puz I'm going to end destroy really sun. So fuck you. One, one, one. Oh yeah, and if you know any gothic nams, please tell me, cause I need one for serious one. Thanks. I went into the con med room thinking of Satan. Suddenly I gasped. Draco was there. One, one, one. I grasped. He locked as hut as Eva, wearing black leather pants, a black lonkin prack t shirt, and black eyeliner. Draco, what the fuck are you dong? One, 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 I gasped. Huh? he asked. Then I remembered. It wasn't Draco, it was Lucan, one. He still had two arms. Oh, hi, Lucian, one, I said. Im Ebony, the new student, lol. We shook hands. Yeah, Satan told me about you, Lucian said. He pinted to a group of sexy gothic guys. They were sitting in a corner cutting. It was serious, vampire's dad and snap. All of them were wearing black eyeliner and black good shraloot band t-shirts. Listen, I'm in a goth band with those guys, he said. We're playing tonight at the Marilyn Mason show as backup. Orly, I asked. Yeah, he said. We're called X like X to your X. I played a gutter. Spartacus plays the drums, he said, pointing to him. Snap plays the boss. And Jamez plays the guitar, even though we call him tomorrow after Samurai in the ring. Hey, bastards, I told them, and they gave me Death's Touch Sin. Suddenly I gasped again. But you don't have a lead singer, I asked. Lucian looked dawn sadly. We us too, but she did. She contempted suicide by sealing her wrists. Oh my fucking god, one one. That's so fucking sad, one. I gasped. It's okay, but we need a new lead snigger, Samoro said. Well, I said him in a banad myself. Really? asked Snap. I couldn't believe it. He used to be gothic, one one one. Yeah, we're called Baldy Gothic Rose 666. Do you want to hear me sing? Yeah, everyone said. So the guys took out their guitars. They began to play a song by, get it, cause by guys are so sexa, one one, Gurn Day. I walk this empty street on the boulevard of broken drums, I sound sexily. I do not own the lyrics to that song. Everyone gasped. N up B, will you join the band? Pulls one beg Lucian some more serious and snap. Um, Ark, I shrugged. Are we going to play tonight? Yeah, they said. Ark, I said, but I knew that I had to get a new outfit. I walked outside, wondering how I could go forward in time. Suddenly, someone jumped in front of me. It was Morty McFly! One! He was wearing a black banad t-shirt and black baggy jeans. What the hell are you doing here? One, one, I asked. I will help you go forward and him, enemy, he said seriously. Then he took out a black Tim machine. I went into it and suddenly I was forward and him. One, one, one. Chapter 36. Author's note. I said stop flaming, Ark. One, 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 one. I met your owl, probably old, seventy year old. One, one, one. Puz, Portisars, you're a prep one. Oh yeah, and thanks to Raven for thy help. One, one, one. Have fun in England, girl. One, 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 one. I locked around in a depressed way. Suddenly, I saw Professor Sinister. B. Inches, Loddy Mary, Socrates, and Draco, Vampire, and Willow were there too. Omphsorius, I saw you and Samoro and Snip and everyone, one, 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 one. I can't believe Snap used to be gothic, one, 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 one. Yeah, I know, Sirius said sadly. Oh, hey there, bitch, Professor Trevelry said in an emo voice, drinking some Volksmort serum. Hi, fucker, I said. Listen, Satan asked me out to a gothic cornet and a movie, so I need a sexy new outfit for the date. Also, I inches am playing in a gothic band, so I need an outfit for that too. Oh, my Satan one! Get it, lols, cause she's gothic. Gasp B inches, Lodi Mary. Want to go to Hot Topic to shop for your outfit? Omph! Let's have a group cutting session, one one, said Professor Trevelry. I can inches T fucking wait for that, but we need to get some stuff first, said Willow. 
Yeah, we need some potions for Professor Trevelry so she won't be addicted to Vox and Wart's room anymore. And also, some love potion for enemy, Darko said, resultantly. Well, we have potion class now, Willow said, so let inches go. We went sexually to potions class, but Snap wasn't inches tea there. Instead, there was Cornelio. Fuck! One, 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 one. Hey, where the fuck is Dumbledore? One, one, one. Draco shouted angrily. SGFU one. Shouted Cornelia. Fuck. He is in Azkaban now with Snip and Lupin. He is old and weak. He has cancer. Now do your work. One, one, one. My friends and I talked angrily. Can you believe Snap used to be gothic one? Vampire asked surprisedly. That's it, 1-1. One, one. Cornelia fuck shooted angrily. I'm getting Professor Bridge! 1-1-1. One, one, one. He stomped out angrily. Me friends and I began talking again. I began to drink some blood mixed with beer. Suddenly I saw Hagrid in the cupboard. What is he doing? I asked. Then I looked at Draco. He was wearing tons of eyeliner, and he looked sexier than Eva. Suddenly, Hargrave, what the fuck are you doing? He shouted. I looked around. Hagrid was putting something in my glass of blood, 1-1. One, one. Darko and Vampire started to beat him up sexily. God, you're such a poser, 1, I shouted at Hagrid. Suddenly, I looked at what he was putting in the blood. It was... Amnesia portion one one one.